what's going on everybody? Dogman Denton here. It's time for the Void Trader. And with the update of 2170, you can now see where the Void Trader is on your map, on your system, if you will, on your alerts. He actually shows up here so you know where to go, which is awesome. So we're going to come back over here. Uh, you can see it's really, really busy, but I'm going to hop on down to the Calm. I've already had a chance to look in there. So... And obviously by the title of the video, you already know what it is that we're talking about. The big goes boom boom explosions that are going to happen. Um, always a fan of the self-kill, if you will. Because, um, yeah. Anyway, let's, let's hop over there. I am using my Nyx Nemesis because I played with the PBR a bit. And I always liked this skin. So we've got her out at the moment. Uh, I cashed in all my ducats, and okay. Oh my! Now here is someone with great. First off, there's two new things. There's a display, Argyle, and a Prisma Angstrom. So, the Prisma Angstrom, which means I'm going to have some fun with some Forma and all that good stuff. B, it features a boosted charge and reload speed. Uh, on it. I have not played with it yet, but the blast damage and all that fun that is involved, and I can go boom boom and blow myself up. If I remember correctly, I can actually blow myself up. So we'll take a look at that in just a second. Now, the other thing, um, you've got your slash mods in here and the display. So this display is actually really cool. Um, I actually am going to pick up a second one here. Let me just get that so I can show you because I'm actually using this uh, Oberon display because it's it's Oberon and it's me you know what I'm saying the Oberon got it so it's a good price here uh, so let's come out and see what's going on uh, leave the relay so I can give you a bit of the update on these two uh, item so really cool excited about the new prisma weapon it's on larunda so everybody pretty much has access to it which is awesome basically the display okay the display shows uh under the universe anything that you've pretty much unlocked in terms of images so anything that's within this codex that i've unlocked i have access to and i'll show you here how that works and let's just get over there let me show you. So I've got the Oberon one up here. You can set the angle and adjustments and all that good stuff, right? Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and take one. Let's go into our equipment, landing craft, place decorations. Let's do one over here. Uh, you're going to look for it inside of your stuff. So there we go. Display Argyle. Select it. First, I'll rotate it. Let's say like so, okay, oops, click it to confirm. Now it gives you the chance to offset, change the scale of the image. You can move it around however you feel like, okay, which is really cool. Um, but you can also swap the image. And again, this is going to be based off of everything that you've already unlocked, fan art, anything. Anything that you really like. So I think that that, for the 100 ducats and the 75,000 credits, it is definitely uh, an awesome thing. So anything inside of your stuff, again, that you've unlocked, you actually have access to. So if I wanted to put the void picture in, I can. If I want to come up to uh, default image, that's my default image, which is obviously Oberon, but we already got that. Let's say I wanted to put a dojo in there. I wanted to put... You know, uh, what's his name? Uh, in there, let's say, where am I really at? Well, I'm, I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. Let me see. So, oh, more fan art, but it's Oberon. So there we go. So let me just choose that. Now, obviously, I would prefer to put Oberon with the Necros in the background. Let me scale the image back a bit more. All right, so there we go. So we'll go with that. And that is where I'm going to keep it. And yeah, so I'm scaling it there just like so with Necros in the background over on there. 
Select image filter. I haven't really played with it, so really, I guess you could. That's cool too. Definitely awesome. And then we just exit that and uh, exit to lock it in, and there it is. So now our decoration is there over on this side, over on this side. That's awesome. I think that's, that's a great little thing. Uh, and then back over here, as you can see, my arcas are still all unranked. They just came out. I haven't had time. I'm just getting out of work now. And again, you know, everybody, if you already watch my channel, you know about the hurricane preparations. We are pretty much as prepared as we're possibly going to be at this point. Hopefully, I've got like one more thing I want to get, but uh, that'll be it a little bit later. It's basically some extra ice. So angstrom, and actually, you know what I want to do because I haven't used it in a while. So let me just click on the angstrom. Okay, so I have it in my equipped and let's come down to the Prisma Angstrom okay and then you can see so Prisma Angstrom has a slightly hard, higher charge rate 5% more critical chance and a slightly faster reload speed but everything else is the same and those things could work out uh, depending upon how you, you play it I, I don't know about the critical chance really being much better but yeah I mean I'll take the charge rate and the reload speed being a bit faster because more boom right so, and then if you're looking at the actual stuff here, it's just the one D slot. It's always a D slot. But that's okay, because if we stick with the blast damage, we are perfectly fine with that, especially if we are utilizing our prime... Oh. Oh. Maybe not. Oh, really? Okay, that's right. No, that's on... That's on... That's on the other weapon. The... Got it. Never mind. Okay. Oh, we could put Fulmination in there and really, really make yourself go boom. So, anyway, those are the two couple things that are really cool inside of the uh, Barracateer this week. And, and everybody really pretty much has access to it since it's on Mercury. So get yourselves in there, get yourselves your ducats, and uh, get those items. Definitely get those items this time around. Uh, and uh, stay tuned. I will catch you guys soon. Thanks for tuning in.